What's up, everybody? Kristen here. I'm so excited to bring you Amber Fry today. What's up, Amber? Hello. How are you? Oh, my gosh. Okay. So first and foremost, tell us who you are. So my name is Amber, and I'm a business coach, and I specialize in marketing strategies and helping business owners create processes to streamline their business. Oh, so good. Did you guys hear that? She is a marketing ninja. <laughs> and I'm so grateful. We fell into each other's orbit only a couple months ago through a Facebook group. Is that right? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. Power of networking, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And um, all right. So talking about like say yes to seven figure offers, the system and the broader idea of saying yes and figure it out. As far as I know right now, you're really living that ideology of like, say yes and figure it out, even as it relates to you and I collaborating. So tell us like what was standing in your way and why you knew you needed a change. Um, just myself was standing in the way and, you know, that pesky full-time job <laughs> that, you know, so many of us have to deal with as we're building, you know, our own business, but it was definitely just not believing in myself and not believing that people would pay a lot of money for what my skills are. So I just, I've been loving to learn the system and getting out of my way and just taking the action. Yes. I think it's um, for a long time now in my orbit, I've been talking about superpowers and like, I'll stand on a big keynote stage and ask the audience to like, write down what their superpowers are. And then to go back, maybe, maybe they have colleagues to go back to work and ask them what their three colleagues, what their superpowers are, because you kind of hit on it. We're often too close to our own strengths to realize what other people really will pay for. So tell us more about what some of your superpowers are as it relates to marketing. Um, Definitely just creating a strategy to for lead generation and email nurturing because email is still so important in getting sales. So just knowing how to talk to your audience and even how to get more emails through, you know, different lead generator ideas and using social media to complement that. Yes. So good, Amber, because to many of us who are not marketing ninjas, we're like, wait, you know, that skill set, that's so incredible. So what were some of the things other than yourself that really were standing in your way? Like why, what compelled you to want to be like, hold on, Kristen, I think you have something that would benefit me. I think the system would work for me. Yeah. Just have it actually having a system a lot, you know, I've worked with other people before and I don't know that whenever you don't have an actual system with specific steps, it's hard to progress because you don't know what the next step is. So I just love being able to follow a system and knowing, okay, this is step one. Now this is step two and so on. And just following that. And not, that allows me to keep out of my own head. Right. Yeah. And there's the system of taking imperfect action, which is to decide, take a step, lean in and then celebrate. And then there's the system of how to take what your superpower is and allow yourself to think bigger, charge higher prices, um, and really create an offer that's going to resonate with the masses. Yeah, a hundred percent. Oh my gosh. Okay. So what else about you or your amazingness do we need to know? So I just, I love working with small business owners and entrepreneurs and just helping them scale and grow because I know we all look for that time freedom, money freedom. And, you know, it's just being able to give more people an avenue to reach that. And I love, I love doing that. Well, and I can vow you are so good at that. I cannot wait to see where you go and where our collaboration goes. So thank you so much for being here and sharing some of the things that were holding you back. Mm, thank you so much.